And how do you make hydrogen? Uh, we use a Coca-Cola bottles, yeah. and we put a carbon stick in in. Um, we put carbon stick and well, first we nanocoat the, the Coke bottle. Um, we put um, a tube coming out of the Coke bottle into another uh, bucket of salt water. We put um, a um, carbon rod in the salt water itself and one in the Coca-Cola bottle that has um, uh, salt water also. Um, and also some uh, caustic material. In my case, what I do is I chop up little pieces of Coca-Cola bottles and put it inside the, the, uh, um, the Coca-Cola bottle itself. So what I'm doing is I'm pulling all of the plastic has a CH bond. So what we're doing is we're pulling out the hydrogen out of the, uh, the bonding with the, the plastic. It takes quite a while. I poke a hole in the Coca-Cola bottle at the water level so that we can get a uh, reaction with the power. Um, and um, we, collect, we collect three different materials, one in the Coca-Cola bottle, one in the, um, I'll call it the container itself, um, outside the Coca-Cola bottle, and then the third one where the tube from the Coca-Cola bottle goes into the uh, salt water. Um, each one of them has a different color. Uh, the one in the Coca-Cola bottle typically has a, a bluish tinge to it. The one outside the Coca-Cola bottle typically has more of a black carbon look to it. And the one in the... Um, the other, um, where the tube goes into, has a goldish, a goldish color. Each one of them has its own uh, properties of, uh, of hydrogen. Um, they all act a little bit different, though. Comments? I'm listening. It's too That's complicated. I never made it that complicated. It's hard to make. That's why it took me 20 times to get it ready. For everything. Shall we, what shall we do with him? Shall we gans him? <laughs> um, there, there must be an easier way to I know I done it that way as well, but you can do it the same. Um, one of the easiest ways is to, do, to use aluminium for atomic hydrogen. Um, a slow process, not a rapid process, cold caustic and let it slowly evaporate. What do you see when the GANS is completed? You, um, you um, don't see anything in the water and then after a while you see black stuff at the bottom which is the GANS of the aluminium. But the gas releases atomic hydrogen. You can do in a plasmatic condition if you understood what I just, it's on the screen how you make CH3, you can make a condition that you create a CH bond field in that process. That you create deuterium and again you create a condition with the deuterium, with the CH3, that you create balance of hydrogen. The process you have here on the screen allows you to create both tritium, deuterium and uh, hydrogen atomic in a plasma condition in a very fast way and you see it by the color. If you look at here, if you look at this space, if you understand it, here you had a carbon. Now you need to create a condition of CH, which is very easy. So what is left in interaction from here leaves you with H2 and if you can create a CH2 then it gives you hydrogen and this process is very easy to produce extremely easy
that's using a plastic bucket, correct? Uh, yes, but it has to be totally sealed. Totally sealed. That's how you get the CH bond is through the plastic, right? No, we, we get the carbon from the CHG to be extracted. And it does, you see the change of the color in the CHG on the top as the carbon is released. Can, can this be done with the plates outside of the container? You can try. It's done before, but you can try. But then you need to use a very narrow, narrow container. And if you use glass, do you have to introduce plastic into the into the, no, into the condition? No, it with the glass. The glass gives you more purified. Even on the top, put a glass. If it's a glass container, you're 100% sure it's, a, it's, it's tritium. The, this tritium is not radioactive. This tritium is extremely volatile in energy. When you touch it, you feel it, it goes through you. You feel the energy of it. It's those who come close to it will not eat for days because it's an instant energy transfer at a very high potential. And it's, the body takes everything it needs in one go. This is one of the ways you feel